and here are a few interesting logarithmic equations. The question here is find the zeros in simplified form of the following functions. First one is f of x equals to a to the power of x minus 2. The second one is h of x equals to log 2 of log 16 basis 16 of x plus 2. When we say zeros that means f of x is 0. So let's solve one by one. So we get 0 equals to a to the power of x minus 2. Now we can bring 2 to the left side. So we get 2 equals to a to the power of x. 8 can be written as a power of 2. So we can write this as 2 cube, right? So we get 2 cube x. Now comparing the exponents, it is 2 to the power of 1. We get 1 equals to 3x or we get x equals to 1 over 3. You will note that in the first question, we haven't even used logarithms. So whenever you have exponential equations and if you could write them with the common base, you can compare the exponents and find the answer as we did here. So you don't even have to use logarithms in some exponential equations, right? Let's do the next one. h of x equals to log to the base 2 of log to the base 16x plus 2. Zeros means h of x is 0. So we get 0 equals to log to the base 2 of log to the base 16x plus 2. So we can bring 2 to this side. So we can write now as minus 2 equals 2 log to the base 2 of log to the base 16 of x. Now we can write this in exponential form. So we get 2 to the power of minus 2 equals to log to the base 16 of x. 2 to the power of minus 2 really means what? It means 1 over 2 squared and that is 1 over 4. Let me read, write this as 1 over 4 equals to log to the base 16 of x. Now we can write this as, again in exponential form, as 16 to the power of 1 over 4 equals to x. Square root of 16 is 4 and square root of that is 2, right? So we get our answer as x is equals to 2. So that is how we can solve such equation. I hope that helps. Thank you.